What is up my ride is first things first if you guys like the car videos we do have merch as you guys know yesterday we were doing the tune on the GLI the JB4 well today it's actually nice out we can get data logs <laughs> so we're gonna run up I'm actually gonna grab zip ties I'm gonna run up with my sister's car so that I'm not like driving it and just having it being thrown everywhere I'm really concerned about when I drive that it like slips and falls or something. Then we get to send that over and he will be able to start helping with turning the boost up. Guys, I'm so freaking excited to get these data logs going. I have no idea what it's going to be like. I have no idea what power I'm going to get. Nothing in that nature. So it's all kind of a surprise and I wanna, I wanna just bust it out and get it going. You can tell by the sky, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. You guys can tell that it's about to rain. So your boy's trying to get home as soon as possible. I got two different size zip ties and new electrical tape so I can tape everything off. We'll be back in one, two, three. And we're home. All right, guys, um, I'm gonna run and quickly do this. My thought process is pretty straightforward. I'll let you guys know as I'm doing it, but I gotta run the little wiener dog inside. She came along. Looky here. It literally only took the time it took for me to get there to come back to be charged. That is so freaking weird. We were only gone for like 20 minutes. So weird. There's something legitimately wrong with the battery. All right, so we got smaller zip ties and big ones. I figured the big ones should be able to go around the JB4. And we're also, I gotta remember, gotta zip tie the wires to the a charge pipe real quick right, guys i wanted to show you the thought process real quick too of buying electrical tape so i heard a lot of people say online oh it can get rain in like rain from just splashing up and stuff so what i did was just to be extra extra um the little divots the little um tabs that you could pop up i taped I said is i'm going to go around each side one other right where these tape marks are with this, just to have something to use as slack, and then we are going to go bam and bam, like we did before, to secure it back behind this. All right, guys, now it's right in there, and like I said, it ain't going anywhere. Um, I don't know if you even can see it, because with the light, we zip tied with minis on these to the actual body, which had zip ties, and then I just did a zip tie on the bottom of this, then the top of this, just so that in case there would be any wiggle for some reason, that it would like try to move one way or the other. You actually can zip tie them together on both sides and then it creates the force of both directions. So clamping down and then across. So <laughs> it's, it's not going anywhere and that's not even the intake keeping it. That's now I'm just going to quickly zip tie with two zip ties down on the charge pipe itself just to make sure that this that I brought up doesn't get in the way. Yeah, we're pretty much ready to take her out and data log now. All right, your boy needs to go get gas now. Why all that stuff slash? Probably because of the JB4. I do have it on map zero. I'm gonna show you guys here in a second. That's what he said I should log. It's supposed to even rain till three o'clock it says and right now it's only 12:30. but look at the sky bro i'm trying to beat this because we've been waiting on data logging all the time and of course i should have just ran and got zip ties last night but your boy didn't even think of it because short term memory loss we're gonna go get gas i'm gonna bring up the tune after i get gas can we just say right now that my uh, luck is terrible today I literally just went to put gas in at the local like gas station near my house that's relatively close and now I have to drive out even farther with zero <laughs> miles, I didn't even notice I was that empty, um, to another gas station because I did my car twice and it said air both times, that's weird. It is literally me like uh, having a stupid ass card. So apparently you have to have a certain amount of funds in your checking it doesn't even matter if you have it in your savings, it has to be in your checking. And if you don't have that amount in your checking, you can't pay with your debit card for gas because you have to have a certain amount of money. So of course I didn't have that exact amount of money. So now your boy has to uh, pay with cash, which I, I mean, I don't care, but I'm saying that's fucking annoying. Then I will show you what's going on finally. All right guys, you wanna turn your power on then go in here 
connect to JV4 connected. And now we're going to go to data logging and we're going to start. I have my thing in tablet mode. So I'm gonna have to start the car up first, obviously. Now that it's connected. Um, map zero, like he said. And I'll have to do start when I'm ready to data log. Like I said, I put my laptop, it's in one or whatever, so it folds into a tablet. So I have more room when I'm driving because we're gonna have to do a third gear pull. So your boy is gonna get out somewhere you can do a third gear pull and then try to do this with everything on his lap. Oh yeah, and rule of thumb, do not data log and drive. That is like one thing that JB4 does not recommend and I am not condoning. Um, literally this cord is not long enough and my sister isn't around to help right now. So um, I'm just gonna be doing it myself. All he wants is for me to start a data log in third gear as slow as I can in third gear and then romp it above 6,000 RPM. I'm supposed to do a couple, which I'm going to attempt. And I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to record, but I'm gonna try my best. Oh, this is actually kind of freaky. Okay, so I gotta make sure there's enough room in front of me and enough room behind me. I'm gonna start. guys and now what I'm doing is titling it data log one there's an export um, area and what you're gonna do is just try to export it and it's gonna say as a JB4 file save it literally was like insane though there's not really any roads around here to take it to that point so I was flying I'm about to find a better spot to do it and I'll get back to you all right guys I'm gonna try to record me data logging again but it is super sketchy trying to do this and I do not recommend anybody do this. I'm gonna try my best because you literally have to press start logging before you like mess around. All right, damn in that car in front of me, I will catch up to him very quickly. Start. Do not recommend doing this at home. Luckily, we do have back roads that are like miles and miles and miles along. But like I said, if there's a car behind you or in front of you, they're not going to want you to slow down. And you also don't want to fly into the car in front of you. So I literally just like purposely slowed down because no one was behind me to get this log because I would have caught this car in front of me so fast. Now I got to export it and then send them over to him and I'll get back to you. All right, guys, we're back home sitting still. Now I can do it. Um, when I said export data logging start and then stop um, and then export JB4 and you want to type, you want to actually click the JB4 CSV so it saves the actual thing. It even says if you're saving uh, an image, it's not going to be the full thing. All right, guys, apparently I didn't have my foot on the floor enough. So um, we're gonna have to redo it again and my sister's gonna have to come along or something because I have no way of recording this. He said I need to like keep it mashed to the floor. Kind of hard, like I said, on back roads it's, or any road really because there's not that much to go by. Not, not, the, not that like open road, but we'll try again. All right guys, I hope my sister's recording all right. He said that I didn't get full pull. Like I didn't hit 100% of the throttle. I got to like 98. So I'm gonna try to do another log here. I gotta go down, click start. Right when I start doing the third gear pull, and I also have to be as slow as I can in third gear, and it's starting to rain. So your boy is like pissed. It sucks. This literally sucks to do, guys. Just so you guys knew. guys i got another log but the thing that sucks is of course the place is only open eight to four so they're only open for eight hours and uh your boy had to run around all day today but tomorrow will be the continuation of the data logging so i'll continue this on to tomorrow because i think that was what was top voted on twitter anyways that way he has some time to gather data and everything with my car and uh I'm gonna have to probably get a couple more pulls. I just went out and got a 100% throttle pull and I verified that it was 100% throttle, but he's probably gonna want more. So we're gonna have to figure that out and probably do that tomorrow.
All right, guys, update time. That actually worked what I sent him. So he sent me some values back. So I'm going to load up and connect to JB4 again. And he wants me to start using map six to uh, change the settings. We did have it on boost safety uh, 20 PSI. We are bumping it up now to 24. So I'm gonna show you guys here real quick just to give you an idea. All right, so right here it says map four. First, go over here and connect. You wanna have your car on. Now I'm connected. Now you want to go over here and pick map six, like he told me. Okay, see it goes to six. Just boost safety to 24. Is that to 24? Now, but now I have, um, he gives me all the RPMs that I'm supposed to change. So here's the file that is showing and I'm going to change that and then get back to you. All right, guys, we're going to try to get the data log right here. This is at peak, uh, 20, 23 PSI peak. All right, guys, it's next day. I specifically woke up at 9.30, around 9.30, to take the car out because people are going to be at work, so I should be able to have a lot easier time data logging. But we're going to take it back out. We're on 24 PSI cap now, and we're hitting 23 PSI peak at 4,000 RPM. Yeah, your boy is kind of nervous. <laughs> I don't know if I showed you guys this or not, so I'll put it in if I didn't. That's kind of what we're looking at. Obviously, you're building boost up, and that's really cool that he does that, how you can gradually build and then come back down. And we're hitting, we're supposed to be hitting roughly 23, so, yeah. All right, guys, I have no idea literally what to expect. I mean, today is a nice day, so we don't have to worry about the weather anymore or it randomly raining. It wasn't letting me completely give it the juice yesterday. I mean... It did feel quicker at acceleration, but um, it's building It's building that boost up. And once I hit like the 23 peak, um, the, the little bit of rain of the um, asphalt was just not agreeing and it was spinning. You could tell it just kept making that backfiring sound repeatedly. It might shake a little bit. You guys are on the um, sunroof attached with the suction cup. I'm really excited guys. I'm really excited to see what she's capable of. Alright, that was a good one. That was definitely mashed to the floor. When he says it's not mashed to the floor, I have no idea. It, I mean, it, it does, I can view it, and I see that it was like 98% before, but still, it's like, bruh. So, I don't know if I told you guys this or not either, but obviously, like, you have to data log, and that's, like, something that you just naturally have to do with these things. But the sketchiest thing is that usually I'm not driving in third gear as low as I can go all the way up to six grand. You know what I mean? You're usually like dropping down if you're racing on the highway or something, just doing a friendly like pull. So I'm going to do a quick pull from first gear at a stop sign maybe. But it's like when, when I do a full pull in third gear and have to go like to the six grand and a little bit past, it's kind of sketchy because your car is getting up to speed. You can definitely feel the 23 PSI. I'd say the only sucky part about data logging is waiting for the response back because you're already so hype. <coughs> I was messing around with it. It definitely is pretty quick. All right, guys. You know how I consistently upload, and since I wouldn't be consistently uploading for two days in a row now, definitely want to get today's of the combination of the two days, but I will definitely, definitely, definitely gather everything up 
and do a cool finale for tomorrow or the next day however long it sucks because you have to kind of like i said wait on the data logging and stuff and i haven't heard word from him yet today we're still making progress and that's all that matters and it's uh definitely feels quicker um not in the realm of what i'm thinking but we're gonna keep pushing in what we can do i hope you guys are hyped because the finale will be awesome i love you guys make sure to be happy stress less thank you for tuning in i'll see you in the next one as always